In the language of the Gitsan people, the name Skeena means River of the Mists. Today I'm outside of Prince Rupert, BC, on the Skeena River, right where the Skeena meets the sea, and uh, we are going to paddle across a little over two and a half kilometers across to the south side of the Skeena where we're going to find Frizzell Hot Springs. Let's do some soaking. We're going to paddle before we soak. Let's test the water. Oh yeah, that's hot. I brought my thermometer, so this will actually be for science. This is a nice large tub. You can fit lots of people in there. It's deep and the water temperature is perfect. You couldn't ask for more. I'm surrounded by super tall trees in this temperate coastal rainforest and it's absolutely beautiful. This hot spring is, uh, although dilapidated and old, is just right. I'm the only one here. This place is awesome. Now because I came all this way for science, let's see what the water temperature is in this tub. I'll measure it right here. 38, 39, 39.5, 39.6, 39.7, 39.8 Okay, the hottest reading I'm getting right here at the tub is 39.8 degrees Celsius. Okay, we got the temperature at the tub which was 39.8 but now I followed the pipe up which to what appears to be the source right here. Let's take the temperature at the source to verify if the information online is correct. There's bubbles coming up from the ground so it does look like this water is coming from an underground source. I try to get it all the way down in there without submerging the electronics. That's interesting, the uh, spring seems to surge. Every couple minutes it goes down and then fills back up again, it kind of surges. 40.6. Ah, I'll call it there. So there you go, the science you never asked for. I took my thermometer and I put it right in the source as far as I could, and I only got 40.6 degrees Celsius. So the number online of 46, I think it's a bit high. I can't verify that that's actually correct, but my measurement could be wrong. <laughs> I like this place. The only thing I have to say that's not going for it is it's getting really overgrown and uh, dilapidated. This shack behind me is about to fall over. I mean, it's not at a 45 degree angle yet, but it will be soon. All the wood is rotting around the tub. The tub itself is in good shape because it's stainless steel and that thing isn't going anywhere in a long time, but all the supports and the deck, and there's just a lot of garbage strewn around up here pretty unfortunate. There's a jerry can and shards of glass and cans. So 
that's the only thing I'd have to say that's not great about this place. Otherwise, it's fantastic. And uh, I'd visit here again. <laughs>